Well, with, there's absentee ownership here now. And uh, I, uh, I'm, I'm not in favor of it. Uh, one of the reasons is that those who have it are not voters here. They don't have any control. And secondly, <clears throat> many of the absentee owners have money and have changed the modest Carmel attractive house into somewhat of a nightmare of a mansion. Not all. Now I'm going to cough again. <clears throat> um, however, when I walk Carmel, particularly in the southern south part of it, or any place else, every house looks almost different. Each one has their own conception of beauty. And the variety is incredible. You go to San Francisco, you know, and you see out the, uh, there and all these ticky-tacky places that are exactly the same. But each one in Carmel is a little different. You will find four or five different styles in, on a given block. And I think that still exists in a grander scale. But the theme is the, the, the the theme is there, or the, the emotion is there, whatever you might call it. And that's good. Mm -hmm. As far as impact of, of you were saying about um, non-residency, except for their destroying the houses, the modest houses, and, and, modest, and modestly attractive houses, the modest and attractive houses, and putting up the mansions and voting, well, I wouldn't say that there's much of an impact. That's mm -hmm. plenty. Well, that's a significant amount.